What's up, me guy? What's up, my guy? My guy? What's up, it's your boy, Naji Saleh, a.k.a. Benny before the Bronx. Holla at you boy. Yes, I said Naji Saleh. Yes, I'm Adam Salas, brother. If you don't believe me, I'm a swear to God. Wallah, I have a brother named Adam Saleh. So, why would Adam Saleh ignore his own brother on Twitter? After I asked him just a simple question, maybe because of all the tweets that he'd be getting, maybe, you know, he, he just didn't see my tweet. I'm going to give him the benefit of the doubt, but it still remains the fact that even if he didn't see the tweet, he should have called me, says, hey, Guy, Naji, my brother, I won the fight and uh, I would like to dedicate this fight to you. And sh he should have announced it publicly. No, I'm not going to be that guy. You know, the obsessed, deranged fanboy. I mean, who's Adam Saleh really? Why are you so obsessed with me? I love you, bro. I really do. I love you. Forgive me. You know I didn't mean it. Please. <laughs> I love you. So, what was the question? The question was just really simple. It was a simple question, really. Uh, a very, very reasonable question. I asked him, what did he fight Face Sensei? You know Face Sensei, the guy that fought in the undercard between uh, uh, KSI and versus Logan. Um, Face Sensei, a lot of people are talking about him. They're trying to, you know, the, a lot of suggestions Face Sensei to fight Adam Saleh. And this is something that was brought up during the time of the, the fight between KSI and Logan Paul. Uh, Face Sensei and Adam Saleh, as a matter of fact, made several videos um addressing each other on the fact that you know if they're you know um if there the, can be a fight between the two i think adam Saleh respectfully declined the the the, 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 the challenge that face sensei himself matter of fact um actually said because face sensei if uh, you know he if you know who face sensei is he's an mma fighter and an experienced mma fighter and uh, he had his uh, MMA uh, debut uh, this year, matter of fact, I believe, um, which he lost, but, you know, people lose all the time. The point here is that he's an experienced fighter, and that's the point. So was Adam. Adam is an experienced boxer. Now, Adam Saleh, of course, he's more uh, experienced in boxing than uh, Face Sensei, but the uh, Face Sensei did have a, a fight, a, back, a boxing fight, like I said, that he was in the undercard in uh, KSI versus Logan. So he has his experience in boxing, and he's an MMA fighter, which actually means mixed martial arts, which means any type of martial arts. And technically, boxing is considered a martial art. Um, so, Faith Sensei has experience in that. So, I asked Adam Saleh on Twitter and hope, hoping that he replies to me, even, uh, you know, if hundreds of people are tweeting him every day. And, you know, maybe he's, he did want to see my tweet, but he was like, who's this guy? Why would I even, even like, why would I even like, acknowledge that tweet? I, I don't know this guy. Whatever. I mean, I'm a fan. I think you should acknowledge a, a, a fan. I am a fan of yours, Adam Saleh. I mean, why wouldn't you reply to my tweet? Is it? Is it because of my beard? Is it? Is it because of my age? Can I be your fan? Please tell me that I can. Please, Adam Saleh, don't do this to me. God, no. I'm from Yemen too. The point here is, would face sensei versus Adam Saleh be a great fight to watch. In my opinion, I think, honestly, it wouldn't be. Why? Because I saw Face Sensei, yeah, let me say the guy has some experience in boxing, but not very good, okay? Not Adam Saleh's level. I mean, Adam Saleh is just a great boxer, really. I mean, if you've seen his fight, if you've seen his previous fight, not only the fight that he just recently had in London, but all the fights that he had, is top-notch boxing tactics. It's top-notch boxing experience. I mean, Face Sensei had that one fight where you see him fighting, um, and, and even in the spars that he had with KSI, I mean, he's not that good. He's not in Adam Saleh's level. He's strong, sure. Oh, you could make the argument. The guy is powerful. He got a powerful punch. I mean, you saw him, like, hit his opponent in the in the liver and, what, and brought him down to the ground. I mean, that was a K KO. That was a TKO. What are you talking about? Of course, Face Sensei is a great opponent for Adam Saleh. What? His speed, though. 
was he being fast? Is that his speed, or was he taking it easy, as a lot of people claim in the, in, in in my comments down below over in my last video? No, I don't think. I think that was his actual speed. I think that's how fast he actually is in boxing. I don't think he's a great opponent for face for Adam Sada. But that being said. He is the one that makes sense right now. He is a fighter. He is an experienced fighter. So is Adam Saleh. And let's see what happens. Maybe he that maybe he was holding back. A lot of people claim that over over flow whatever his name is his opponent in the in the in the undercard with uh, KSI versus Logan Paul the, his you know face opponent in that fight um, is actually a friend of face and seeing that's why he actually was holding back and wasn't really giving it all he can give. If that's the case, then maybe it can be a great fight. I don't know. The point, like I said, again, um, face sensei and versus Adam Saleh. Here's the conclusion to that. It does make sense. Why wouldn't it be? He's an experienced fighter. So is Adam Saleh. Um, if Adam Saleh want to get it into this realm of YouTube boxing, because I, for me, I think he's being neglected a lot, and I think why the reason why Adam Saleh is being neglected by KSI and Logan Paul and all these other fighters who are not really acknowledging his existence, basically. I mean, KSI didn't mention him once after a while, after a lot of people started bugging him, including myself, when I on on, his, on one of his videos when he was talking about who's my next opponent, bullshit. Um, you know, before he uh, accepted the fight, I guess. I mean, he, Adam Saleh was the most voted one. When he that when KSI did that poll, who should who should he fight? Adam Saleh was voted the most, and I'm one of the people that voted. I'm just mentioning this so Adam Saleh would know that I am actual fan of his, and won't you know hurt me again in that reply to my tweets. Come on, man, what I do to you? Why you so obsessed with me, boy? I wanna know. Again, here's the point. Adam Saleh should be acknowledged. And Slim so should also be acknowledged. He fought Fusi Tube, who Fusi Tube was talk of, talked about by Jake Paul, by everyone. Jake Paul mainly calling out Fusi Tube, wanted to fight Fusi Tube. Fusi Tube finally showed his fighting skills. And, you know, not to bash Fusi Tube, but it was horrible. He has no skills. He was a sucky ass fighter. Um, and maybe, you know, there are factors to that situation. Um, but anyway, the point here, Slim won the fight. He should also be acknowledged and taken in seriously to this fighting trend that's going on in YouTube, uh, boxing trend. And so was Adam. Adam is a great fighter and he should be taken seriously as well and talked about. And, uh, if FaZe versus Adam can happen, it should happen in this undercard and this rematch between KSI versus Logan Paul. But I don't believe that Adam Sal is going to actually do it the reason even even if it can be set up right away even if like you know okay face sensei said yes to the fight between him and adam and adam i don't think adam is gonna take it because adam is I don't, he said it before you know he fought marcus why he was marcus was oh way much heavier than he was and that's dangerous, and it is, in a fighting realm. Because the heaviest has the most power. Adam Slot was just scary, skinny, and he just looked fragile. So, and Face Sensei is also very heavy, and he's over, he's over like, uh, in weight, he's over Adam Slot in power and weight, and there's not going to be a, a great fight, a real even, equal fight, if Adam Slot accepts the fight to i mean the fight is only in november 9th i mean uh, i don't think so man but if he does accept the fight and and if jake paul finally decides to fight gibbs which i now come to realize is going to be a huge fight and it get and it, it will get a lot of attention then Adam Saleh and Faye Sensei can make it a great fight as well, as an, uh, maybe even a co-main uh, event, you know? And yeah, yeah, I think it could happen. I think it should happen, you know? And it all depends on Adam Saleh. If he accepts it, let's see what happens. What do you think, guys? If you liking this, if you think Faye should fight Adam Saleh, when should they fight? 
should give fight Jake Paul. I'm sure most of you will say would agree that they should, as do I. And honestly, I actually want to see Gib fight um, Adam Saleh as well. But it, we'll see, you know. Maybe if he wins against Face Sensei and Gib wins against Jake Paul, uh, it, that might happen. Or maybe Adam Saleh ends up fighting Jake Paul. Maybe Face ends up fighting Jake Paul. Who knows? Leave a comment down below. Tell me what you think. Like, share, subscribe. Peace.